guys, so today I have this really warm brown monochromatic look. I really wanted to just create a look that was all concentrated on warm browns for my eyes and lips, and I think it's going to be perfect for fall, and it gives you like this warm, cozy feeling because these shades are just so perfect for the autumn season, so I think... You guys are going to really like this look. I absolutely love it. I can't stop wearing brown lips, so I'm sorry, guys. You're going to see the brown lips a lot more. <laughs> so I think that should be it. So if you guys want to stick around to see how I got this look, then just keep on watching. I'm going into the Tarte Cosmetics Tarlet in Bloom Palette, and I'm picking up Smarty Pants first. So with my Sigma E40 Taper Blending Brush, I'm going to start running this through my crease. I think sometimes it's really important to have a transition shade because it can really transform your eyeshadow look and really make the other shadows really blendable, and it just completely changes it even though it does get covered up it's still going to really make that look much more blended and blown out and more beautiful next i'm picking up rebel so now with my sigma e25 blending brush i'm going to start running this shadow through my crease this is going to really tie into that lid shadow i just completely forgot what i was going to say it's going to really tie into my lid shadow and this palette guys i have to tell you if you want an everyday go-to palette get this palette it is so amazing. The shadows are so blendable, so pigmented, and they're just so creamy. Oh my god, I love this palette. It's definitely been the staple lately for me. I use it all the time for some reason. Now to darken up my crease, I'm picking up Leader. So now I'm picking up this shadow again on my Sigma E25 blending brush, and I'm going to start defining and darkening up that crease. And this is another shadow that I think is just so beautiful. I love how the palette has a great range of cool and matte what <laughs> cool warm mattes and shimmers and i feel like a lot of palettes sometimes are just concentrated on warm tones or just concentrated on cool tones but this palette has everything so that's why i'm saying it's like a great go-to palette and now i'm picking up rebel on my sigma e40 taper blending brush and i'm just gonna apply that at that high point in my crease just to blend these two shadows together plus it's just gonna bring back some of that warm redness to it so now for my lower lash line, I'm just going to do my lower lash line first before I finish off the top. I'm going to pick up Rebel and start smoking this down here first. And then I'm going to go in with Leader and start really darkening up my lower lash line and smoking this out. And now for my lid, I'm going into the Tarte Cosmetics Tardis Metallic Shadow in Speakeasy. So now I'm just going to pick this shadow up my Sigma E58 Cream Color Brush and I'm going to apply this all over that lid and do you see how pigmented this is the tarte cosmetics metallic shadows are probably one of my favorite formulas they have such a creamy buttery formula and they're just so pigmented to highlight my brow bone i'm picking up charmer so now with my zoeva 234 luxe smoky shader brush i'm just going to highlight my brow bone and just sweep that down just a little bit to clean up that crease area if i went a little bit too high with it to highlight my inner corner, I'm picking up Funny Girl. And now I just cleaned off my Sigma E58 cream color brush, and I'm just going to apply this shadow on the inner corner. And this is just going to brighten up this entire look. I love a smoky eye with a really highlighted inner corner. To line my waterline and tightline, I'm picking up Tarte Cosmetics Tardis Double Take Eyeliner. And now you know me, I have to turn this smoky eye into an extra sultry smoky eye. So I'm going to apply this liner in my waterline. and tight line so now I'm just gonna apply some mascara and fall season lashes that I'm using are these Tarte Cosmetics Tardis Pro Lashes and Goddess and I'll be right back to show you the finished look and that's the I look done so now for my lips I really wanted to keep this entire look really like monochromatic and just all one tone so I really wanted to concentrate the entire look my eyes and lips on a really warm brown that I think is gonna be perfect for fall so I'm gonna do that to my lips as well so I'm gonna go into the Tarte Cosmetics Tardis Lip Paint in Crop Top and the Tardis Lip Paints in the Naughty Nudes collection are all so beautiful a lot of them are kind of similar but some of them are just stunning they're all really brown and some of them are cool brown some of them are warm browns and they're just so beautiful and I've been loving I've told you guys this, I've been loving brown lips. This whole no Naughty Nudes collection has been my go-to collection. <laughs> so now I'm just going to apply this all over my lips. So 
So now I'm going to apply some highlight because, come on, we got to get this cheek glowing. So I'm going to go into the Tarte Cosmetics Exposed Highlighter. Here, let me show you. Isn't that beautiful? So we're going to get these cheeks glowing. And I'm going to pick that up and apply that with my Sigma High Cheekbone Highlighter F03 brush. I mentioned this. You need this. You need this brush if you want that glowing, beaming highlight. This packs on highlighter like there's no tomorrow. So this is the finished look of my warm brown smoky eye paired with a warm brown lip. I hope you guys enjoyed. I love this look so much. And I'm telling you guys, get this Tartlet and Bloom palette. I know it's not new, but it is bomb. You're going to love it. And you're probably going to use a shadow or two out of here every single day for your looks. It's just that great and has so many great range of mattes and shimmers and cool tones and warm tones. And also that metallic shadow. The metallic shadows by Tarte. Dead. Some of the greatest formulated shadows I've ever felt amazing yeah I just get so excited when I see products that I love and I feel like I want to share them with you guys because I feel like you guys are gonna love them as well and yeah so if you guys want to follow me on snapchat Instagram and Twitter that'd be right here as well as down description box and also a list of all the products that I use today will be down description box along with where you guys can find them and don't forget to let me know what other looks you guys want me to film what other shadow combinations or colors or techniques you guys want me to film for the fall or just in general Leave them down in the comments below, and I think that should be it. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye!